There's the Libertalia right there. This is high level enemy territory. One of them may have a fat man. If he does, that's going to be a bitch. There's a Corsa right there. He's going to totally screw up your sneak. I've tried this a number of times and it, it's, you know how it is with NPCs. You don't have to bring them along though. What you can do is play a little bit of dirty pool with the game and instead of meeting them, down them. <laughs> that won't kill them. It'll just take them out of the action just long enough so you can get by them and then uh, you can continue and do the whole mission on your own without his <coughs> help. Yeah. Okay, we got some guys tagged up here. Let's get it on. Peekaboo. The thing I like about this uh, six crank power blaster, I'm not getting benefits from the Mr. Sandman perk which gives you a bonus for uh, doing sneak attacks with silenced weapons, but it just, it kicks out so much damage. And it's going to kick out even more damage once you get the uh, rifleman for, yeah, six times uh, 64 now, because I've got Psycho, right? So there you go, 360 damage, and then sneak attack. Okay, so my drugs are wearing off, time for a little more. Fucking cow! Let me just double check here, we discovered the Libertalia. I should be whacked out of my mind on Mysterious Serum, Psycho Buff, and Orange Mentas, that's correct. And why don't we do a a little bit of a wine chaser to give ourselves a little bit more action points. There you go. <laughs> Whacked out of my mind here, boss. <laughs> Alright, quiet on the set, I gotta focus. We want to go right there. Now, if we can get our sneak on, best thing to do is just go up here, put on your hazmat suit, and swim for it. So that's what we're going to do. Excellent. Just want to make sure I can't be spotted here. There's another guy right there. Okay, cut the shit. Who is that? Yeah. <laughs> 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 
Okay, watch your flanks, people. That's where they're gonna come down there. Okay, he's a little shaky over there. This is exactly where you want to be, because there he is, right there. Reason being is he can't launch his fat man at you down here. It's impossible. Just die! <laughs> Just die already! Here we go. Me, huh? <laughs> okay, time for a little jet. I don't want to waste this jet, so let's get up there. Haha, <laughs> miss me. It's really cool how I can see that Molotov coming. In slow motion jet. Okay, that was plan B, by the way. In case you get busted while you're down there. Oh man, come back! I was having fun! Okay, I just want to loot these guys here. Don't want a pool cue. Don't want a pool cue. What's your story? Another yeah, totally useless legendary. I wasn't even aware that he took down a legendary. <laughs> That's right. You can say that again. Okay, so this is the chem station level, or, or rather the. Uh, the toolbox level here, that's what I like it to call the toolbox level. It's got face. a toolbox and a chem box here. I dare you. Chem station level is up up one. You better run. Okay, let's get our sneak on. always paces back and forth. When he turns around and goes back, there he goes, let's whack him. There you go. Come on out. This is bullshit. Only a fucking coward hides. This is the chem station level, okay? There's a chem station right there. Okay, what do you got? You were a legendary too? Huh. That's not bad, actually. Okay, whacking up the legendaries here, boss. Let's take a quick look around. There's the, the way to go up. Just noise. Just noise. Take that alarm clock for some nuclear material. And this level is clear. Payback time, Pokemon. Uh oh. <laughs> I've been busted. Where is he? There he is. There he is! Check it out. <laughs> Dropped your fat man. Shit, that fat man went in the water. 
Okay, and this conveniently places us right in front of where we want to be. The table that has the US US Covert Operations Manual, which is one of the reasons we came here, the main reason we came here, right? So that is the tenth and final copy of the US Covert Operations Manual. We got them all now. Alright. Check it out. You can go to your stat specials, scroll on over the perks, scroll on down to covert operations, and we got them all. Yeah! Yowza! Yeah! <laughs> that was really cool the way they guys did did that guy's head in like that drop this fat man over the side there. It's never played out like that. Okay, so um I believe this is the captain's cabin level. No, it's not. We have to go up one. There's the captain's cabin. Before you go in there, <clears throat> make sure you avail yourself of a whole bunch of booze. In what I'm presuming is the uh, the cabin boys' uh, quarters. <laughs> okay, let me just go quickly back down, and uh, so the area is clear. Take a look around, grab some stuff. Okay, refill our health. Don't need a beer bottle. That guy went over the side, can't loot him. Huh, I didn't know there was a safe there anyways, I can't open it. Okay, I'm good with that. Let's go up to the captain's cabin. As soon as you go through the door to the captain's cabin, the courser whom you left behind will rejoin you automatically. Did I get that? Yeah, that's cool. You want that actually, because uh, you'll see why. Psycho buff is worn off. It's worn off. Let's take a little more. A moment, sir. There's something important I need to tell you. I'm listening. I'm going to give you B-592's reset code. If he hears the code phrase, it'll reset his cognitive processes and make him docile. You'll need to say, B-592, initialize factory reset, followed by the authorization code, Gamma-71 Epsilon. Once he's shut down, I can transport him safely back to the Institute. Good. I'd like to avoid any unnecessary violence. Well, he might not be alone up there. <laughs> violence might be inevitable. That's all, sir. Ready when you are. Oh, yeah, and sorry about, the, you know, shooting you in the head back there. We were just, you know, <clears throat> trying to avoid any unnecessary violence. <laughs> all right, so uh, in the captain's quarters, don't forget this thing right here. It's a unique weapon, Le Fusil Terrible. Perfect. Um, it's a shotgun that has plus 25% damage and limb damage, but has more recoil. I'm not a big fan of this. I see a lot of guys going apeshit over this weapon, but I've tried it extensively. And uh, the recoil really ruins it for me, so I'm not a big fan of it. But, um, yeah, I think maybe it would be probably good with some jet. That would probably be the best way to use it. Or in vats. But the problem with using it in vats is it has such poor uh, accuracy and range that... Uh, I don't know, it, it has some very specialized uses, that's all I can say. Okay, so, we are ready. Let's get some extra XP for... Uh... Cracking this nice. stuff to open. Take some dirty water and the antifreeze bottle, definitely want that. The Braxo cleaner and the mini nuke.
and take the ladder upstairs. Alright, there's Gabriel. Let's go talk to him. You there. so desperate for resources that it's stealing plunder from honest, hard-working Commonwealth gangs. Well, um... B-592, initialize factory reset, authorization Gamma 71 Epsilon. Okay, now, as soon as that happens, go down here. Shit, they did something to him. Get ready. What the Crank up your power blaster and get ready to rock and roll. This is the perfect position, to, the perfect place to take up a uh, position. Because what happens is your courser takes up position over there. So you got him perfectly flanked, you just totally raped them. Even though the whole thing, like, you know, goes down very suddenly. Hang on, we're looting here. 688. Ready to relay with reclaim synth B592. Beam us up, Scotty, and that's it. That's all there is to that. Couple of things that you pick you can pick into or hack into there if you've got the right perks. And we're done. Let's get out of here. Let's go back to Daddio and get some XP. Get a big pat on the back for reclaiming this synth. Daddio being father at the Institute. I wouldn't be here, not for your son. Hey, daddy -o. I'm glad to see you return safely. I know the task was difficult, but I needed you to see firsthand how dangerous a rogue synth can be. Gabriel and his gang were sick bastards, hanging their victims up like trophies. I'm just glad it's over. While we can do nothing for Gabriel's victims, we can at least take comfort in the knowledge that the threat has been removed. But enough about that. The task is done. You've returned our synth safely to us. I couldn't have hoped for a better outcome. Uh, well done. Thank While you. you were away, I had quarters prepared for you. You'll find all the basic necessities, as well as a generous stock of arms and Go and have a look. I think you'll be quite pleased. Okay, and I'll show you exactly how to get there to visit your quarters. Is that a bottle of bourbon behind you? Can we take this? I knew it. It's not Mark Steele. Thanks, Dad. <laughs> and I'll take that clean globe there, too. Okay, to get to your quarters, here's what you do. This is the easiest way I found to get to the quarters. Maybe there's an the easier way. Go upstairs, go down this long, curving hallway here. And go downstairs. Father's a great man. He yeah, yeah, yeah. All hail the institute, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Your new quarters are here, sir. Thank you. There you go. So we visited our quarters. He said, like you know, he left a healthy supply of ammo. It's really, it's not that much actually. It's nothing to get excited over. That's all it is. This stuff here. Okay, so we completed synth retention, and there's our XP reward. Here's our quarters at the Institute, and we have now started the Battle of Bunker Hill. I'm going to call it a video right here. I'd like to thank you all very much for watching, and if you thought this video was remotely entertaining and or informative, don't forget to give the old slacks or a thumbs up, and subscribe to my channel for more kick-ass Fallout 4 real walkthrough videos. All right, I am out of here.